Morocco. Rabat. Welcome to Rabat, Morocco. I'm in Morocco right now. I'm taking a tour with Gate One. We are in the city of Rabat. Look at this, it's a walled city. So there's like a castle right there. And I'm walking through and there's gardens and the, this is pomegranate season. So there's pomegranates everywhere. These are Roman ruins. Kitty. You're just a little ham. Okay, check this out. These right here are storks. They come here all the way from the ocean. We're actually pretty close to the ocean right now. And these are Roman ruins. They use this as a trading center. That is the stork's nest right there. This is from the 14th century. You can still see the tile work. Tree mosque. God, but Allah, Prophet Muhammad is the messenger. The second is prayer five times a day. The third is fasting Ramadan, holy month. The fourth is pilgrimage to Mecca and Medina, and the fifth is charity. I am in Rabat, Morocco. And I love it. And I love it. Moroccan flag. It has a five-pointed green star which symbolizes the five pillars of Islam. This is the Royal Mosque and Mausoleum. It's a UNESCO World Heritage Site. Look at the guards. Look at his outfit. It's like the coolest outfit ever. He has a cape. This is nicknamed Little Taj Mahal of Morocco. Rabat is the capital of Morocco and recognized as a UNESCO World Heritage Site. This stunning marble mausoleum holds the tomb of King Mohammed V. This is so cool. <laughs> The interior of the mausoleum is filled with beautiful geometric mosaics. It's one of the only places you can take photos with guards. Morocco! Now we drive along the Bourigreg River to get to the Kasbah. Panorama of the city of Rabat. Look at these doorways. Have you ever seen a store this cool? Yeah. 
around the city of Rabat, we noticed tons of cats. Holes in them for scaffolding and for pigeons. Just chilling like a villain. I like, I like some schools, but I'm, I'm very allergic, so. Uh, school's out. studied in American college in Baghdad. Uh, she studied uh, uh, mathematics and then she moved and studied in Lebanon, another American school. And then after that she moved to London. She studied architecture. She became a famous architect in the world. She designed lots of opera houses, bridges, the Olympic Stadium in China. Also, Zaha Hadid. Zaha Hadid. We hope that you enjoyed this tour of Rabat, Morocco. If you liked it, hit the thumbs up button and stay tuned because next up, Fez and Marrakesh.